Hey everyone, in this video I wanted to show you how to set up any song on your phone as your ringtone. And the process is really straightforward and it's actually free using a app that usually comes with your iPhone. So let's go through the process right now. The app we need to do this is called GarageBand. So a lot of times your phone will come with GarageBand so you could search for GarageBand. I'll put a link in the description to this app so you can just click it if you don't want to search for it. It'll launch iTunes or your app store and it'll start downloading it as soon as you press download. Go ahead and download it. It looks like I've already deleted mine just to make up some room. So as soon as this download, I'm going to show you the very next step. As soon as the download is done, I'm going to go ahead and press open. Now I'm going to press continue on the very first page and I'm going to say use GarageBand right here. And I want to go to audio recording. So if you scroll down to the left here, just keep scrolling till you find the option here called audio recorder. Go ahead and tap that right in the middle and that'll launch audio recorder. And we want to go to our track here. So if you tap on the top left, you should see a track icon. I'm just gonna go ahead and circle that for you. So now we're in the track icon. Now on this page on the top right, there is something called the Omega icon and that's right next to the wrench icon. So go ahead and press that. And here you have three options on top. You have Apple loops, you have audio files and you have music files. So the music files are things that are going to be on your phone and the Apple loops are things that are already built into GarageBand. You have those three choices here. We're gonna jump into music because we wanna choose a song that's on our phone. So here under music, you could search by songs, you could search by albums, artists, whatever you want. In this case, I'll just go to artists. I'll just choose the first one here. Even my podcast show up here. I'll choose the first one here. And this is the song I want to drag on. Now, some songs that are not locally stored on your iPhone or they're protected, they're not gonna be able to turn into ringtones, but that is not the common case. So what I want to do is take this song, I'm putting a finger on it, and I'm going to drag it. And as soon as I drag it, it'll bring it right here, importing the audio file to my track. And then if I just bring it right to the very beginning, it snaps to the very beginning. Now, songs are limited to 30 seconds for ringtones. So now I just got to trim this and make it 30 seconds long. So in order to make my song 30 seconds, what I want to do is press that plus sign on the very top right corner and I'm going to change the section to be 30 bars. So if I click that, I could change it manually to 30 here and that'll get me 30 seconds. I'm going to press done and now it's 30 seconds long. So now if I take my song, I am fully at 30 seconds. You see, I'm taking the very far end of this and I'm making it shorter or longer. So 30 seconds is perfect. Now I have a 30 seconds long. So that's what I mean by trimming your song to exactly 30 seconds. So it could be used as a ringtone. So pick your favorite 30 seconds here. You could press play and listen to the song and see which one fits within that 30 seconds. Obviously you want the very beginning of it to be the favorite part of the song that you want to play for the first five to 10 seconds or so. So now we want to click the arrow on the top left. So I'm gonna go ahead and click that arrow and I'm gonna say my song, I'm gonna choose that. Now it's saving it to my song here. So now from here, I gotta choose to make a, a ringtone and I'm gonna show you how to do that. So now that the song has been saved, what you wanna do is click slightly on it and just press and hold and you should get this option, this menu option that should give you a share option right in the middle there. So again, this is where you're at. You don't have to press anything. Just hold the song, not too much that it's gonna open that track, just enough that you get this menu option and then press share and you'll get this new page. In this page, you wanna save it obviously as a ringtone and not as a song, but you can save it as a song or a project. I'm gonna press ringtone here and then it says your ringtone needs to be adjusted to be 30 seconds. So I'm gonna press continue. I'm gonna export my ringtone here as my song. And now I'm gonna say use sound as standard ringtone. So I'm gonna go ahead and press that. 